So here we have the all new Horizon 3-in-1 MagSafe certified charger, which is gonna be probably the last charger you'll ever need for any of your iDevices. But let's talk about exactly what makes this thing so special compared to the rest. So the first thing that you might have noticed is that it is MagSafe certified and not just MagSafe compatible. And I've said this before, but MagSafe compatible just means that it's a Qi enabled wireless charger with magnets attached to it to fit the MagSafe battery in the magnet orientation on an iPhone. But MagSafe compatible chargers still only charge your iPhone at 7.5 watts and it doesn't charge it as efficiently as a MagSafe certified charger would. So this Horizon 3-in-1 is MagSafe certified, giving you a full 15 watts of efficient charging on your iPhone or any iDevice that supports MagSafe. And like I mentioned, it is a 3-in-1 charger, so it also brings a MFI certified Apple Watch charger. And it's actually the new Apple Watch charger, which was made for the Apple Watch Series 7. So it charges your Apple Watch faster than the old chargers, but it still also works with older Apple Watches, all the way down to, I believe, the Apple Watch Series 0, the original one. And what's funny is that actually with the new AirPods Pro 2 especially, you can use that Apple Watch charger to charge your actual AirPods Pro 2, which I thought was a nice little addition with this 3-in-1 charger. But then on top of that, you also have a third charger, which is a 10-watt Qi-enabled wireless charger to charge things like your AirPods Pro or any secondary phone like a Pixel 7 Pro if you are a double phone kind of person. But there are actually three different aspects of this charger which really sets it apart from the rest of the competition. So the first one is the fact that it is all certified hardware from Apple. So you know that you're gonna get the 15 watt fast charging on iPhones, you're gonna get that fast charging for your Apple Watch, and you know that it's gonna be safely charged efficiently and it won't be warm to the touch after you're done. The second thing is the actual versatility of how you can actually use this charger. So you saw in the very beginning, there are really eight different ways to charge and prop up and use this device with all your different iDevices moving forward. So you can lay this thing flat on a desk, you can unfold it and still lay it flat to charge all of your devices, you can prop it up and get your iPhone at an angle, and you can watch things in vertical and horizontal mode. You can also prop it up and have an Apple Watch charger on the side or put it away if you want. So this actually allows you to use it in multiple ways. So you can use it as a travel charger, you can use it as your dedicated nightstand charger or a dedicated desk charger and it all can be used with one device so you no longer need to have a separate travel charger you no longer have to have a desk charger and then a separate nightstand charger and that's the main thing that I love about this thing that it's compact enough to be a travel charger but also sturdy and well built enough to be your dedicated desk or nightstand charger and the third aspect of this charger which actually allows for all those different orientations to take place is the hinge mechanism. So this hinge is actually very, very sturdy, but also soft enough so it's easy to move whenever you are moving it and you're trying to get the correct angle. So if you think about it, you have like unlimited angles that you can put this charger on and set up your iPhone in whatever orientation you want. Like I said, you can lay it totally flat if you would like, and you can stand it up to about an 80 to 85 degree angle if that's what you wanna do if you wanna have your phone in portrait mode kind of to the left or to the right hand side of your desk. So I love that about it because again, the hinge is strong enough to be able to stay sturdy at any angle Angle, but also soft enough where you can easily move it back and forth. Now we'll be fully transparent. This is a pre-production unit, so this isn't going to be the final colorway of this actual charger. Think very space gray on the Apple side. It's going to be made out of recycled iodized aluminum, just like the MacBook Pros and the MacBook Airs in that space gray colorway, which I would love to see. And also in the production unit, they will be adding a secondary USB-C port on the front side of this device for extra mobility and extra adaptability, depending on which orientation you wanna have your new Horizon charger set up in. But that is gonna do it everybody. This actually starts off on Indiegogo on March 18th. If you guys do wanna pick one up, they're doing about a 25% discount if you are one of the early bird adopters. But for nine to five viewers, there will be a link in the description down below to get a total of 40% off of an early bird special, which will only be available in the link down below, which makes this a great buy in my opinion. And it will retail for I believe $150 when it does release in March of next year. So definitely take advantage of that discount while you still can because this thing is going to be not only my nightstand charger but also my dedicated travel charger. And again, this thing is pretty awesome. But that's gonna do for this video. If you guys did make it to the end, leave a little dolphin in the comments down below. Thank you for Amper for sponsoring this video and partnering up with 9to5Mac. And that's gonna do it everybody. Until next time, peace.